Welcome back to another fantastic recipe of the week with Healthy Cooking on a Budget.com. Um, this one is so simple, I don't even know if I can call it a recipe. I will post my recipe below as I always do, um, so you can see what I do, but again, you can do this however you want. I'm just going to talk a little bit about making a popcorn seasoning. Really, really easy, but we can have um, something that's a little extra nutritious for our popcorn and that tastes great. As many of you probably know, microwave popcorn is not only not very healthy for you, it's actually pretty bad. So why not make popcorn at home and put a fantastic seasoning on it that tastes great? Um, the simple tool I wanted to talk about that makes this really easy, and I have this, uh, I use this all the time for a lot of different things, is my little magic bullet. This little tiny blender comes with um, several size jars and um, also a couple different blades, so it's really easy to whip up a lot of different things. But for the seasoning recipe, I like to blend it because for a long time I just poured my seasonings directly on the popcorn. And for one thing, that can become labor intensive because every time I make popcorn, which is pretty frequently, I had to grab seasonings from all over my kitchen to make it the way I wanted. So my husband actually, thank you Isaac, came up with this fantastic idea to make it ahead of time, blend it all up, and when you put it on the popcorn, it actually sticks much better because it's in the powdered form. So a couple of things that are really good in here, nutritional yeast flakes, of course, we've talked about these before if you've been watching my video channel, and really high in the B vitamins. Um, one thing that I really have gotten to enjoy putting in the popcorn season is turmeric. This is a really good um, seasoning that's not very commonly used unless you're into like Indian spices and stuff. But it's a great addition to a lot of things and it's perfect in popcorn. High in antioxidants, high in vitamin B6, and also in a number of minerals. So you can't go wrong. Adding that in gives it a perfect little flavor. Um, I like to put onion in it. Dill is also a great flavor. And of course a little sprinkle of cayenne if you like something a little extra spicy. So again, make it however it suits your taste buds because you can't go wrong. But the nice thing about blending it up is that once it's blended, and I have some to show you here already, put it in a little container, and here you have a perfect seasoning that can sprinkle right on your popcorn, and it's great because you, have, you can use less oil in the popcorn and it sticks so nicely. Use as much or as little as you like and enjoy. As always, please subscribe to my YouTube channel to check out more fantastic recipes and or follow me on my blog at healthycookingonabudget.com. As always, eat healthy to be healthy and I will see you next week.